Hi guys, Slime Red here. I actually want to talk about the troublesomes that you know I have during weight loss. And you know, quite honestly, I noticed that everybody goes through this, but it's not talked about so much. You are gonna have days you're gonna have errors. There's gonna be days that you have gained weight back. There's gonna be days to where you just suddenly binge that one day and it just sets the whole thing off scale. And then there's going to be days to where every little thing that you're trying to do to lose weight pisses you off. It's so true. <laughs> but, um, for me last night I was doing yoga right here. This is where I do my yoga. That's my mat right there. And... So, every little thing that I was experiencing trying to do yoga last night was pissing me off. The way my hair was moving, because I have some loose strands when I have my hair up. The way that it kept coming to my face was pissing me off. The way the headphones were sitting were pissing me off because I was using them to listen to instructions. And then... The way my hoodie was sitting on me was pissing me off. The way that my sweat rolled down my face pissed me off. The way my leg didn't want to move the way I wanted to was pissed me off. The, the way the water tasted pissed me off. Every detail was pissed me off. I mean, it, it went down to the way the mat felt. It went to the way I lost balance. Every detail of what happened last night was pissing me off so bad. I actually had to pause what I was doing for yoga and take a break, take a breather, drink a little more water, and then went right back to it. When you have those days that, you know, piss you off, take a breather, take a break, and push through it after you're done with your break. Because you want to continue to do better for yourself, you want to push. Even though you don't want to. Because that's what I call a nope day. To where you don't want to do anything that you just didn't like how your workout clothes were fitting. That you just didn't like how you're walking that day. To every bit of your day was nope, nope, nope. That's fine. Like I said, take a breather and push on. There are going to be days to where you're going to be eating great fruit a week. You're watching what you're eating. You're counting your calories. You're doing your water. Everything was going smooth. You feel better. You feel lighter. And then when you get on scale, you all of a sudden you felt fat. Like insanely fat. Because you went from one weight to a higher number. And you're going to be like, what did I do wrong? Did I sleepwalk into the kitchen and eat? But there's going to be a few reasons for like girls. One, it could be because you're going to start your menstrual cycle. And you do get um, a little heavier during this time. You get more bloated. And then there is the salt routine, which is not fun. And then you're also going to have the water retained as well. Last week, my numbers did climb up. After, you know, I was watching everything I was eating. I was doing my water. I was trying to make sure that my food intake was a little lower where it should be. That I was chewing my calories instead of drinking. And I felt bloated after, you know, I saw my weight and I was getting frustrated and I was on I felt bloated every day and I was like it's not fun so I took a water pill that helps to like get rid of water waste I felt better I didn't feel as bloated and then um I actually looked at some of my food I was eating some of it had a little higher salt than the rest so I had two reasons why I was heavier. Two. And I was not happy with them. But 
how to overcome, you know, the felt of defeat, the felt that you can't do this, that it's just over, you're not going to lose weight anymore, forget it, it's not going to work, no, 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 no. What you need to do is continue. Don't let this set you back. You want to continue what you're doing and what you're losing and learn from it. Ow. Ow. And learn from it. God, that hurt. I just pulled my hair. But learn from it. Learn what you could do next time. Keep pushing. Keep going for it. You are worth it. You are. And you're going to have days to where you're going to feel defeated. You are. There are going to be days to where you just bloated all week. You can't handle it. There's going to be days that you don't feel confident. There's going to be days that you just want to pull your hair out like I just did. <laughs> but you have to keep pushing no matter what day it is you have to keep pushing don't set back don't stop working out don't stop eating right don't stop drinking manly water keep going it is very very hard i know i have a poster that i actually could see right now that is journey of weight loss and I had probably about a month and a half I didn't do jack squat I felt defeated I got sick I just I went a whole nope phase and so sorry my back started hurting so and I'm looking at it and seeing those empty slots with no weight on it because my weighing days are Mondays. I felt bad. I feel bad now, but I am trying. I'm going to keep pushing. There are going to be days also that you're going to be so sore that it turns into a nope. You need to push through them, but don't overdo it. Don't do it to where you don't like it. And one way is that you can help yourself to keep going. Try to make it fun. Try to make it to where you're just like, alright. And also, keep your goal in mind. What you're trying to do. Because when you do that, you can do anything. Really. And, you know, I actually started recording. I lost uh, weight from 230 pounds. Right now, I am 208.2 pounds. But when I started recording my weight loss, I started at 217.8. Barely lost 10 pounds this whole time. And I've been doing it for, I want to say, four months. And I only got down to about maybe 10 pounds. And it was very frustrating. But it helps when you have people that are willing to work with you, coach you, be your workout buddies. It helps so much. But, like I said, there are going to be days where you're just like, nope. Just keep pushing. I think I'm all going to keep doing these updates, how I feel, especially trying to lose weight and everything. This is, I feel like I'm just rambling. So, I'm going to go ahead and end this. And I love you guys. Bye.